I'm going to make chicken Dijon, which is chicken served with this wonderful creamy mustard sauce. The wood oven is a great environment for cooking chicken and I like mustard, so this is one of my favorite dishes. You can make this with a combination of thighs, legs, and chicken breasts, but skin on thighs are my favorite cut, so I have enough pieces to comfortably sit in my pan. This dish requires that you brown the chicken first, so I've dried each piece and seasoned them all with salt and pepper. And then the rest of the ingredients are two slices of diced bacon, one sliced onion, one cup of white wine, 128 grams or half a cup of creme fraiche, 68 grams or four tablespoons of Dijon mustard, 16 grams or one tablespoon of whole mustard seeds or a grainy mustard, one tablespoon of fresh thyme leaves, two cloves of sliced garlic, and some salt and pepper. This dish doesn't need a great deal to go with it, but I'm gonna make some French beans sauteed with some cloves of garlic. And I'm also gonna make some garlic bread to help mop up that delicious sauce. I'll begin by heating up my pan in the oven and then add a little olive oil. Then I'll place in the pieces of chicken, skin side down. And cook until the skin is a golden brown, about 15 minutes. And then turn the pieces over and cook for a further eight to 10 minutes. Or until the chicken is almost cooked through. Remove the pieces from the pan and keep them warm. Pour off all but about a tablespoon of the chicken fat and add the bacon. Cook that until brown and then remove it from the pan. Add the onion and cook in the bacon fat until they are soft and lightly brown. Pour in the wine to deglaze and mix with the pan juices and reduce that down for a few minutes in the oven. Add the creme fraiche, Dijon mustard, whole grain mustard, the thyme, the garlic and stir them all together. Return the pan to the oven to heat through all the ingredients. It will become this wonderfully thick and glossy sauce. Add the bacon. And the chicken, coating each piece in the sauce. And return the pan to the oven for about 10 minutes. At this point, I'll put the French beans in the oven because they're not gonna take very long to cook.
Serve the dish in the pan, garnished with some sprigs of thyme.